Well, after Tennessee's sports gambling bill became law earlier today, we are hearing now from the Knoxville state representative who originally proposed the legislation. At six, we told you the bill passed through Governor Lee's desk, the governor allowing it to become law without his signature. The legislation, which takes effect July 1st, will allow for regulated statewide mobile and interactive sports gambling for people 21 and older. Sports gambling expected to bring in more than $50 million in revenues each year. Representative Rick Staples filed the original measure as a House bill. He says he did so in an effort to keep sports bettors from flocking across borders to neighboring states. Staples reflecting now on the milestone tonight. I really felt like it could happen. We could do it to get colleagues to believe in my intent and support it and work in concert with me. It's good to be a part of positive history and we've created a model piece of legislation that other states are looking at. And although he allowed it to become law, Governor Lee has vocally denounced gambling, saying today, quote, compromise is a central part of governing, but I remain philosophically opposed to gambling and will not be lending my signature to support this cause. The governor going on to say any future efforts to expand gambling or introduce casinos in Tennessee will assure my veto.